Have you ever wondered why so many people once believed the Earth was flat? Let's go back in time. In the earliest human civilizations, people explained the world with what they could see. When you look out across the ocean or a vast desert, the horizon looks perfectly flat. Without modern science or satellites, it made sense to imagine the Earth as a flat disk. Many ancient cultures built myths around this idea. In Mesopotamia, the world was thought to be a flat surface floating on water. In Norse mythology, Earth was described as a flat realm surrounded by a giant ocean. And in some traditions, the sky was imagined as a solid dome arching over the land. Maps reinforced this belief too. Early maps often showed the known world as a flat circle, with mysterious warnings at the edges, like here be dragons. The unknown was literally imagined as falling off the edge of the earth. Religion and philosophy also played a big role. In some ancient texts, the earth was described in ways that seemed flat. And without modern tools to challenge those ideas, they became accepted truths. But not everyone agreed. As early as 500 BC, Greek philosophers like Pythagoras and Aristotle suggested the Earth was round. They noticed that ships disappeared hull first over the horizon, and that during lunar eclipses, Earth's shadow on the moon was curved. These observations hinted at a spherical world. Still, it took centuries for this knowledge to spread widely. For ordinary people, the flat earth idea remained easier to believe simply because it matched what they saw with their own eyes. So people thought the earth was flat, not because they were foolish, but because they worked with the best evidence they had at the time. It was a natural conclusion in a world without modern science. And today, even though we have photos of earth from space, the flat earth idea lives on as a reminder of how powerful, simple observation and, sometimes, misunderstanding can be.